I wondered if I was getting through, but finally he told me to go downstairs and wait with everybody else. I went down into the comparative cool of the shape-up pit, where the extras and bit players sit waiting for the call. Some of them have to wait a long time. Some of them strike up lasting friendships. Some of them haven't worked since Gandhi, the man, not the movie. An hour went by that felt like a year in a sauna, but finally the lucky names were read out. Hello, just listen to me. The following persons have to reach Film City by morning 9 a.m. with suit. Anwaris, Rajan Varsava, Parid Varsava, Nirbhai, Ghani, Prakash Tirbati, Anand Rai, and Clive James. Bombay actors are very generous, and none of them physically attack me for winning a part they would have given back the eye teeth for that they got from the pavement dentist. They said various short Hindi words, which I presumed meant good luck. With my precious work chitty in my sweat-soaked pocket, I went back out to Film City in the familiar limousine. They were still making Marjorie's movie, and the first shift of extras were breaking for breakfast. Inside the soluble castle, the famous fight arranger and stunt director Ravi Dewan was setting up for a big fight scene. Ravi was a busy man, but while I was waiting for my love scene with Marjorie, he very nicely agreed to fill me in on the Bollywood movie business. I persuaded him to take me to another part of the soluble castle, where it was quiet enough to talk about the downside of his profession. Is it dangerous being an Indian stuntman? Very dangerous. Yeah? Why? Because we don't have safety uh, like Hollywood people have. Don't have enough money to put a... Uh, I mean, take time and energy and then airbags, we don't have airbags here to jump or some firefighting equipment. Just let me do this slowly. You, you jump without airbags? You fall with we them? jump without airbags, but we put some boxes. What about you? You ever get hurt? I got hurt when I broke through glasses because we don't have sugar glasses here. They, they make you jump through real glass? Yeah, we go through real glasses. You've done that? Yeah. I've done it. You can see the marks and, and scars. Show the me that. Yeah. You went through a real window? Yeah, on my knees, on my They stomach. pay you extra for that? Yeah, they pay extra, but like, uh, not worth. Is the sequence I'm in, is that an important part of the movie? Yes, very important. All oh, right. It's a small sequence, but it's very important yeah. sequence. Do I get a costume? For yeah, I got something which will fit you properly. Anand, costume. Down below, the word was out that a new acting sensation had been discovered. The transformation was dramatic. I was disappointed to discover that Marjorie hadn't yet arrived. I thought I was going to be playing a love scene with her, but it turned out that I was going to be in a fight scene with two heavies who handled their weapons as if they had been born with them. Come, Clive, are you ready? Yeah, I guess so. Ready? Yeah. You rehearse with them, with them once, and then we'll see. Okay. Yeah, ready? You're going to do it slowly? Yeah, slowly, yeah. yeah very slowly. Very slowly. Okay. I put in a request to rehearse as thoroughly as possible. It wasn't that I lacked agility, and no one has ever questioned my physical bravery. I was only afraid of getting cut by that sharp thing the other guy was holding. Yeah, this. I'll do that, yeah. Having taken heed of Ravi's warning that Indian stuntmen not only look as if they are defying death, but actually are, I tried desperately hard to remember what I was told. But remembering isn't easy when you're up against a medieval warrior in dark glasses. Yeah, and pull you back. React, react to this. That's good. Like that? Yeah. Okay. Action! 
While my rehearsal continued, the male lead, none other than the famous Anil Kapoor, was setting up for a less crucial scene in another part of the castle. He was facing the problem of keeping his hairstyle intact under growing pressure from the plot. My rehearsal was starting to speed up. Barely suppressed gasps from the other sword fighters indicated their awareness that their jobs were under threat from a prodigious new talent. Anil Kapoor's hairstyle was under threat from his disguise. How to make the most of both his hairstyle and the disguise covering it up was a problem it took an hour to solve. Is this the real one? Yeah. Taking! Ready? Are you ready? Ready! Action! Finally, my fight scene was ready for a take. The camera rolled, I did everything right, and died a death which I thought was marked by that understated authenticity otherwise so lacking in Bollywood movies. The other actors for a moment feared that I might really be dead. How was that? Okay. Good. You don't think it was too, you don't think it was too hammy towards the no, end? No, no, no. Is that a take? Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Right. Thank you. Thank you. Worthy opponent. <laughs> Ravi said he had never seen anything like it. I got a lot of offers to star in Bollywood movies, but I had to say no. After two weeks of Bombay's trickle-down effect, my shoes had filled up with sweat so often the soles were peeling off, and I didn't have a shirt left that hadn't been smacked to a rag. Also, I had the first twinge of toothache in one of my remaining upper molars, and although there was at least one skilled dentist locally available, I preferred to have the trouble seen to somewhere else. It was time to say goodbye and good luck. I don't know whether Bombay will make it as a prosperous Western-style society with fair shares for all. I don't even know whether we've made it. When Gandhi was asked what he thought of Western civilization, he said he thought it would be a good idea. How much graceful poverty do we have amongst all our graceless wealth? But the days are gone when we could come sailing in from the West Take a look at the picturesque inhabitants and say, stay as sweet as you are. They've had enough of being patted on the head. Now they want what we've got, and it's their turn. It couldn't happen to nicer people, and they might even manage to stay nice when it does. <laughs> <laughs>